been into the, in the Soka Mona and the Groovy Mona and this year will be my first time into the Calypso Mona. <laughs> When she bet work like for me, when she do work like for oh, me, you go with me, my not a time. When she do it, when she went down, got set the games on me. Well, right now it's all about meet the artists, and we're here with Finba, Devon, Andrews. Everybody know him as Short Pre, Belmont, Kiariko. But basically, when Short Pre, the home is all about writing music, listening music. And when I'm down in Grenada, I always right here around the stadium area, River Road area. And you know you have a lot of Caracol people around the place, so I always feel at home. We also have a little band in the school with them guys just be playing keyboards and playing the guitar. And we also be doing our little things right there. So I guess the interest for music started right there in secondary school. Zingo came to Caracol with Talpri and Talpri called me up on the stage and we was doing things together and Talpri was like, wait now. Well if you're so good and, and I tell people from tonight I took all your shot free. <laughs> and Zingo saw that and Zingo actually wrote the first soca a song, Zingo wrote that soca and he captured the Caracol Road match in 2001. Well from there we came to Grenada the same year and make, made it to the Soka Monarch semi-finals on his first year 2001 and did it again 2002 where I had this massive tune everybody was, was singing which was released very early in May, in May end, end of May. But now Chichi man, and that tune just kicked off right through the carnival and from there everybody basically get to know short free. Well I've been into the group in the Soka Monarch and the Groovy Monarch and this year gonna be my first time into the Calypso Monarch. I've studied Calypso for the past seven months very seriously. I've taken um, some CDs from the past with Katie and Kroko and some of the older older guys make sure that I understand where, where they was coming from, how they used to get the, the public and the fans to kind of interact with their topics and I've been listening to them very hard for the last seven months so that it could pay off in this, this season, Carnival 2011. Well, we have the first wrong song from um, the topic came from the uprising in the Middle East, and I chose the country Tunisia because Tunisia, the uprising in Tunisia, was a non violent uprising, the only violent force was the, the ruling party and the, 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 fa the people of Tunisia matched against that violent force without even raising one weapon and still come out victorious. So I'm doing a, a, a first wrong song on Tunisia, the uprising. And the second wrong song, which is probably the most popular song in Grenada this year, is I Want to Be a Pastor, Profession Change. <laughs> this is my last If you're following me from 2001 to 2011, you know it's 10 years. After 10 years, you know the level of maturity in the business, it, it, it steps up a little. So at least you're, you're confident and you're comfortable in yourself to know that at least you could try to take a chance to go into the more difficult journey of the music where it all started as a matter of fact. So I came with two different ideas, come out from the political business. So when people come into the stadium March Granite, at least they, have, they know they have one artist who could give them two songs that they have nothing to do with politics. So they could come with a free mind, clear conscience to listen Calypso, Calypso on that night. It was amazing actually that was my first ever performance singing a, a calypso and doing it with the band and it was it was amazing me and the band only had one practice and to see how we went down on that stage that night it was it was very amazing the encore of course it's first time encore in calypso <laughs> having to understand that a calypso encore is different from a soca still trying to figure it out but it was very amazing for, for our first performance I was very pleasing the fans always have something good to say to me and even though somebody says something bad you always try to listen because you never know what that comment or how that comment will build you or mold you in the future. So definitely, mostly everybody in Grenada probably know Shopee. From the past when I just started, I always used to think that writing a song in, in a week or a few days was made you a, 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 great, a great artist, a great writer. But as I say, getting mature in it and even as the years go by, I realize that that's not the case. You know, putting a, a song needs a lot of effort and a, a lot of time. You need to build on you, you need to grow with you. 
So that when you when you're performing it or when you when you're singing it in the studio recording, at least you could feel it as part of your soul. Definitely I take at least a month to, to write and get used to one one song. Tell me how you like it. That is how we like it. What is the short pen I gotta say? You're watching Meet the Artist. Meet the Artist? Yeah, we surely got this. Oh, yeah.